Tour Nottingham Forest YouTube channel. Hello, Ben. Hello, hello. Great to have you on the line. Great YouTube channel name, I have to say. Uh, today's result, a bit of a bore draw, was it, with QPR? Uh, it was, um, we got paid for like an extra 19 minutes and we still couldn't score. Um, the goal is loud, I don't, I don't understand it, but all around, it, it was another two points loss, especially at home. Uh, but yeah, and QPR wasn't excellent, but... They got what they wanted a point. Well, yeah, we were we wasn't that good today. It is just one win in five now for Nottingham Forest. That playoff pack is incredibly tight. It's just one yeah. point separating the, the bottom three in the playoffs between them and Fulham. It's so, so tight. Bristol City there or thereabouts. Blackburn yeah. there or thereabouts. Even Swansea now, who you wouldn't have factored into that conversation really prior to getting a win today. Like we know, one match they can change the complexion entirely. What are your thoughts going into the, the back end of the season? You've got 12 games to go now, Ben. Are you confident that Nottingham Forest can to regain that form? Well, our next game's uh, Cardiff away, and that's another important game. Um, all we need to do, because like I said, I think, I think it's from the 12th and upwards. Everyone can get a playoff spot. We need, like I said, we've got a tough fixture coming up. We've got Cardiff, we've got Millsborough. We need to start winning games, especially at home, because our waveform is fantastic. But it's just our home form, like today, we're drawn against QPR, not a good side. One, one defeat, we'll come, we'll come out of the playoffs. So it's going to be a tough, tough 13 games, but I'm still confident that we can still stay in that top six position. What, what do you put, uh, Ben, the kind of inconsistency, not just with, I suppose, Forrest, but the whole of the championship? Because a few weeks ago, Forrest beat Leeds 2 0 in what would have been a great Saturday night game. And then a few days later, you lose at home to Chelsea. Why? Obviously, it's probably a general question as to, to a lot of clubs around the championship. But why for Forest has there been that inconsistency in, in recent weeks, as well as I suppose across the whole season, that one one game can be fantastic against a good side, and then a few days later against a side you should be beating, you don't get the win. Well, it, it is what it is. But our team, we've got a good team. But it's our bench. We've not got a strong bench. It's like today with Sam Basal not playing today and every time we, he played we win so it was I know he got an injury but we should have players come off the bench you can take like Grabbin Grabbin he, he, he didn't play good we've got players like Tyler Walker who's just come from on loan from Lincoln we called him back and he's not getting a chance so we have not got like a strong side on the bench but the strong side like, we've got who's got Lolly uh, Abiobi Silva because they need to start scoring more goals we can't keep relying on grabbing um, to be fair we kept quite a lot of uh, team sheets but it is what it is we, 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 the teams like Leeds and West Brom I think they'll go up the top six I think we'll be looking to get sixth place what? because teams like Sorry, yeah. No, go on. So you think you'll be lucky to get sixth place now? Because, listen, we yeah. were looking at automatic promotion just a few short weeks ago. You went and beat Leeds on that brilliant Friday yeah. night. And you mentioned there Tyler Walker, who'd come in from Lincoln, obviously been on loan at Lincoln from Nottingham Forest, had bagged 14, 15 goals in League One this season, was looking very, yeah. very good. Scored for yeah. you guys to finish off that game. It looked like spirits were high. You had your tails yeah. up. But now you're saying that maybe not even sixth place. No. Oh. Like I said, it's, it's the teams below us. Like, I think it's Bristol City, Swansea, and I'm sorry to say, but even Derby. I know Derby in 12th place, and they couldn't even reach the playoffs. So, like I said, our next game is away to Cardiff on Tuesday, and I'll be there. <laughs> if we lose that, we'll, we'll drop them to ninth. So, we've got to stop winning games. But I think, I think, like I said, if we, if we can end the season, like, I think, oh, I still got, I think we've still got Derby away. Teams below us, we need to start winning games. Big time. Like I said, it's a massive, massive team against Cardiff on Tuesday. Yeah, it is huge, Ben. Have you done your YouTube video for tonight? <laughs> I'm starting to edit now. <laughs> nice. We'll keep a lookout for it, mate. Nice one. Thank you very much for joining us. That was Ben Dorr from Dorr on Tour.